What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Sinister. You already know Team RG. We in the building, rise and grind. Hope everybody feeling good, feeling great, working hard to be successful. I got to catch up with another Team RG member out here in hot Las Vegas. My boy Courtney. What's good? People? Driving for Swift. He finally he he been praying to the Universal Law. Hey, I got Red Cross Sinister, so the, today was the day it happened. We got the picture in. Now we're doing the video because I'm doing the Team RG meetups for us when we retire. We'd be like, man, I was out there doing the time when Team RG and Sinister, and we was out there, we was running, we was getting the money. Yeah. Now, what made you get in the truck? Oh, man. Well, we're going to get we gonna get down to the nitty gritty. We got to give them the motivation, the inspiration. So. Everybody got a story to tell, and this man gonna tell you his story. Well, I was working this, you know, the typical nine to five. I was at Home Depot, and then I was talking to the drivers, and I had a good conversation. Right. And they were telling me, "What do you want out of life?" You know, like I said, I'm not married, I ain't got kids. Right. So I figured this, man. Uh, my real dream was to do some real estate, and a lot of people still I knew, can happen. I know. Now you use this money to invest in. Hey, thank you. Okay. okay. And and, okay. and the thing is, is. I talk to a lot of drivers and that's what they do. Right. They drive and then on, on, and on, on part time they have properties that they right. flip a well and I wanted to do the same thing. And um, I, and I just like the freedom of it, you know. Right. It's, it's, ain't nothing to it but to do it. Don't talk about it, be about it. It's the same, you know what I'm saying? My mom had this old saying, it's either you barbecue or you build it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, right, you know, right. so that's what I did, you know. Right. What were some of your trials and tribulations coming in the truck and considering trucking? What were some of the things that you heard? The doubt? Well, besides the, the typical negativity of the haters. Right. You know, shout outs to the haters. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to the haters. For you. Right. But, um. Motivated by the haters. The, the problem is, don't believe what they tell you because, right. believe it or not, right. When I got to trucking and when I was in the, the school, I was doubting myself. You right. know, I, I really thought I couldn't do it and wouldn't, you know, make but every time I took the test, when it came up, it was right. 100%. Right. Because at like, one, I had faith in myself and where I was going. You see what I'm saying? Right. And, and I knew I was going to make it, so that's why I kept on and keeping on, you know? And besides, like I say, I don't care if you're homeless. I don't care right. if you're... I was in, I was in a situation where my significant other was just telling me negativity. She told me straight out I was going to fail. Wow. Right. Point wow. blank. And I was like, you know what? Wow. Let me roll. And this is, it's like sleeping with the enemy. Yeah. Like, you don't think I can do it? No. Like. Like, wow. this is going to be my support system. But like I say, I hate this as I motivate because you never know where the blessing come from. Right. You got to go through dirt to find the diamonds, bro. Right. You know? Right. right. And I realized that. I was like, you know what? I see myself as a work of art. And every work of art got to go to the kiln. Yeah. You got to go through the fire. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I went through the fire, and I'm a work of art. And I love it. And I thank this guy here and all the other guys that made videos. I'm going to make myself some. I told them, like do I the said. YouTube, do it, because your story is different than mine. Exactly. Everybody got a story to tell. Exactly. You know, everybody got different people who follow them. Everybody got different trials and tribulations in life, and your trials and tribulations is different than mine. Now, it might be some things you went through that I can, I've been through that might be similar. Right. But see, that's right. what I'm saying, y'all. Y'all got to get out here. Even if you don't want to be a truck driver, Go for what you really want to do in exactly. life. Go for that passion. Don't let somebody tell you that you can't, you won't, because all they doing is putting their limit of their grind onto you, and they exactly. that's their own doubt. That's their own lack of confidence and their ability. And sometimes them people could be your own parents, people that you think that's supposed to love you. you Uncles, sisters, and, uh, brothers, yeah. nephews, But don't, like nieces, I say, don't take it personal. Wives. This is, Husbands. They never they never achieved anything, so they feel like it's nothing for you. You go out there, you achieve it, and then you'll see how you inspire and inspire them. I'm gonna yeah. tell you, man, I thank God every day. Yeah. Every day. Yeah. Because you know what? I'm sitting down, watching this video, <laughs> like you. <laughs> watching you this know? video. And then I say, you know what? Forget it. I just it was like what do you call it? A leap of faith? Yeah. Yeah. Cause I didn't know where I was gonna go. 
Ain't I remember what? that's what Steve Harvey said, wasn't it? He said, you got to take risks. You got to jump off that cliff. And as you fall in the parachute, ain't going to open right away. You're yeah. going to get cuts and bruises. Yeah. But eventually the parachute, poof. And you know, yeah, I was scared too. Yeah. You know, I was doubting myself like, man, yeah. Yeah. I ain't never drive no stick shift. Like, never even drove a stick shift This car. is a building, man. You driving a, you know, <laughs> one story building down the road, yeah. you know. What, what, what advice could you give some of the people that's sitting home that's doubting it, that's got that, you know, they scared, they nervous, they got that All fear. Right. Fear is the number one thing that'll stop your success. I'm going to tell you like this. Tell. Okay. A lot of people don't realize this. We're getting older every day. Okay? Right. We're, uh, I used to listen to this uh, motivational speaker named Les Brown. He said, oh, it's possible. Ahead. It's possible. Just keep saying to yourself, it's possible. It's possible. Yes. Yes. Okay? Yeah. It's possible. Yeah. Yeah. No matter what it is, it's possible. What, what was the other thing Les Brown always told us? You got to right. be home. Oh. You gotta be more, you gotta be you hungry, gotta, hungry. And you gotta surround yourself you. around people who want and trying to achieve what you're trying to achieve in life. We here because we want better in life. Team RG and other members is here because we all want better. Okay, now that was for the people that's on the couch. On this the is for the hustlers out there. Go ahead. On the street. Gangster, but you're afraid to go for your own goals. You're not afraid of everybody out here. You could, you could, you could scrap with the best of them, right? Slang with the best of them, right? But you're afraid to go for your own dream. You're afraid to do it. See, people expect that of you, but Woo. do something that they don't. Right. Do I'm not. Something. I'm not supposed to be successful the way I am. I'm a. T they look at me like, all right, you're a typical hoodlum, straight from New York City, out of the projects. I'm not supposed to have this following. I'm not supposed to have that much respect that I have. Exactly. Cause they looking at me, they judge me, you know? But I don't let that stop me because I got to worry about the ones that need my help. The critics, the haters, it comes along with the territory. So any of y'all looking to do social media, YouTube, you come in this truck in, believe this. If you build it, they will come. Hey, on another note too, I'm gonna tell you something. Another another saying I had about that fast one. Drop it, drop it. He dropped the jokes. Fast money is like fast food. Right. It ain't good for you. It only <laughs> satisfies you for a minute. Right. But this real money out here, slow money, it's like Thanksgiving. Right. You wait all year for it. You remember it for years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it takes forever to get. Yes. But you remember it for years. Yes. Okay? And it's good for you. You know what yeah. I'm saying? You know what I realized about, about the struggle? The struggle seemed like it's forever. But when you get out here and you finally accomplish the goal, you're like, wait a minute. What happened to the feeling I was just having over the last, you know, four years ago, five years ago, six right, years ago? Right, right. They don't even feel like that struggle was even there. Exactly. Exactly. So, you got to go for it. Go for it. Everybody got the same time in the day, 24 hours in the day. Those that wake up and watch what others do, yeah. don't get nothing. You can only be scared for too long. And the ones that want to be negative yep. got negative bank accounts. They exactly. got a negative in their bank yep. account. I want, I want to stay positive. I'm going to stay positive because I'm on a positive bank account. So. And then, you know, it's pros and cons and everything, man. Yeah, of course. You know? Of course, it ain't easy. And now, let's yeah. get away from the money. Let's get away from yeah. the money. What is the headache of being in trouble? Family, brother, a family member could die on you and you might not get back for the funeral. Right. You feel me? Yeah, a wedding. You might be out here trucking, trying to get that money together so you can get a house and you find out your wife is cheating on you. You miss a birthday. You miss your kid's birthday. You miss a graduation. Yeah. Could be your, your kid's graduation, your girlfriend's graduation, your wife's graduation, your husband's graduation. It's sacrifice. But anything worthwhile comes with sacrifice. Like I said, you gotta dig through the dirt to get the diamonds. Right. Right. You know? Right. Yeah. So, y'all gotta know, everything takes time. Mm -hmm. None of this, I guess I make it look easy. Other YouTubers make it look easy, but it wasn't easy. Going to DMV, 
fell the road test, you know, fell the general knowledge, fell, fell in the air brakes and combination, then taking the road test and fell the road test. And like I said, I fell my road test three times. But look where I'm at now. I ain't give up. I know somebody that used to work with me took the road test twice and said, yo, that's it. I'm not spending no more money. Yeah. And that third time could have been his time. And you know what's so, so drop crazy? Dropping, dropping. We're dropping jewels. We're going right. to drop the jewels on them. My test, the first time I took it, I passed. Right. Everything from the permit test, everything, the first thing. And you know what was so crazy? I was so scared. I was shaking out. <laughs> oh, they had a nickname for me. They called me Willie Beeman. I don't know if you remember that movie, Any Given this Sunday. But I would throw up before we had like a, before we go take a test, we'll do like a little. <laughs> that's a real. Run. But that's oh. good. I'm glad you said, I'm glad you shared that. And I would. <laughs> I'm but, glad but you I, But like that. I did, I did a touchdown, man. Right. I won every time. I passed every time. But just like I say, who I believe in, hey, he ain't no plan, man. Yeah. I told yeah. him. You know? Yeah. That's what I'm saying. What books are you reading? Okay. Oh, man. Let's get into that. All right. Yeah. First and foremost, I'm going to tell you the secret. It's a great book. And I've, I've been yelling at, get okay. the secret. And Another I got it in the truck, one. too. How to Win Friends and Influence People is a great book, man. Make sure how to deal with people, how to manage them, you know, talk to people. Real good book. Right. Um, what's another one? Les Brown has another one. I'm trying to remember whatever. Anything by Les Brown is great. You can go on YouTube mm -hmm. um, and search for Les Brown, Eric Thomas, Eric Thomas, Tony Robbins, yes, Tony Robbins. Um, where, where Eric tells you say, "Thank God it's Monday." Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank God it's Monday. I used to watch that every day on the way to the to the airport job. Yeah. See what I'm saying? We all did it. He did an airport job by their home people. I was only making three twenty nine a week. And I was getting paid every two weeks. Oh. Oh. Get on, out man. of that dead end job. Yeah. And like, I tell you like this, we ain't millionaires yet, but it's coming. Hey, let me spin the camera around real quick. This is Vegas we sitting at. Yeah. Yeah. I'm about to go to the strip in a little bit, man. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. If, if I would have still been working at the airport job, I would have never got a chance to come out here and see this beautiful experience. Whatever because guess area. what? A lot of people live their whole life and stay in their one state, oh. they one city, they or one they hood one yeah. Forever. Never and been outside the hood, bro. I done been to, hey, I done seen multiple hoods. I done exactly. been to Cali. Compton, yep. and all um, been to the Bay. Long Beach. Okay, hey, I'm gonna tell you something, man. I've been to the Bay. It was cool, but when they got the, when they had the uh, the championship last year, oh my god, man. Horrible. Driving through there. <laughs> Horrible. Hey, but you know what? I wouldn't give it up for the world. Man. There you go. I would there give you it up go. For the world. Anybody you want to give a shout out to? Man, hey, I'm gonna give it up to everybody right there. To you standing there, man. Please, please get up. Do something for yourself. It ain't got to be for nobody. Do it for you, man. You can do it. Yeah, you that's what I'm shouting out to you right there. You're going to always that's have obstacles. Yeah. For every new level, there's a new devil. Trust that's me. Right. Trust that's me. Right. And you see, message. You see how the clouds just came over the sun? Yeah. Yeah. Message. Shout out to all my people, some of my family. The Murray family. Right. The Guy family. Right. You know what I'm saying? Carringtons. Everybody. The Jones. Everybody, man. Bless y'all. And all the people that's back at school. You know what I'm saying? God bless y'all. Take What care. school you went to? Okay, I went to a small school in Tampa, Florida, man. Okay. Tampa Truck Driver School. It was a CDS school under uh, Career Tech. Okay. okay if y'all in the Tampa area, y'all check them out. We right got there. an email. We got to shoot them the video. Let them know we sending. We're giving them a shout out. My email is Murray at yahoo.com. You'll see me on you, uh, uh, Facebook. Yep. And Instagram. You know, you can look me up, Courtney Murray, K O R T N E Y M U R R A Y. All right. There you go. Straight like that, man. Hey, be sure to thumbs up the video, share the video, play the video and back. And get out here, man. And get out here. What Come you on. on. Turn, the, need... turn the video off and get yeah, out Yeah, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Any company. I don't care who it is. Just sign up. If go. you got to walk the DMV to get the book, go get the book. Study. Get the permit while you're at home. Don't go to a school yeah. and try to get the permit. Get the permit while you're home because it's more comfortable because when you go to a school, they're going to put that pressure on you to hurry up and push yeah. you because they're paying for the hotel. So. Hey, put the blunt down. I'm t no, I'm saying real talk because I know where I, I come know, from. I know. I always tell them, gotta right. stop this. 
Tell your girl to be quiet for a minute. Hey. Right. If they ain't with you, forget them. How you want to live in the future? Yeah. Do you want to continue to struggle for the rest of your life? Do you want to die broke? Or do you want to get that 401k put away? Do you want to make investments? How do you want to live for the future? Get it while the getting is good, man. Hustle now. Grind hard. Because every year, you lose a step. You get slower. So, we out here doing it. My boy Drive for Swift. As you can see it. Yeah. yeah. So, you ain't got to go to school. You ain't got to go tonight. Just be you soon. go. Look. Everybody got to start somewhere. Everywhere. I started okay. at Warner. See what I'm saying? I started with CRST. And people like, oh, you going to Warner? People was like, you with CRST? You... No, no, people like, you with Swift? Look, do it. Get it. Get your experience. Then go get your own truck. See what I'm saying? You got owner ops out here causing, man, I done talked to some owner ops. I done talked to, man, I'm going to tell you something about, here, about this trucking thing. I done talked to people that's like owner ops. Right. I done met owner op millionaires. Okay, multiple properties, yeah, multiple trucks, Mo all their kids, college funds to pay for, yeah, because they manage their money. And I've seen the other side of the coin. People out here, that's all they got. If they ain't trucking, they would been on the street. Yeah, but you know what? They all say the same thing. I would trade for the world. Yeah, and they got free. I you get know? to see the country and get paid. Yeah. I get paid. I get to do this. I get to run across people that. I done inspired. inspired. Yes, man. That's what makes me successful. Him. Y'all. Yeah. That's why I'm successful. Can't it ain't the YouTube you. numbers. The YouTube numbers don't matter to the people in the struggle. Yeah. That's for if I approach a company, I'm like, yeah, I got this amount of followers. That's what the YouTube numbers, uh, that's when the numbers matter. But when it's this, the fact that he's able to go in his pocket and he no longer have to check his bank account to see if he got enough to be able to go buy something. Somebody that quickly call me. up, hey, I need this, and hey, it ain't no problem. Nah, don't make it a habit. That's my best Right, because then people become, they depend on you and they become a crunch. And then they right. never get independent. Exactly. Well, like I say, man, in the end, you're going to struggle on the couch. Bad don't let that felony stop you, nigga. Oh, yeah, don't let the felony stop you. Don't sit and say, Damn. You can be a felon and drive. Yes. That's for sure. Yes. Yeah. Yes. It yes. ain't no. Somebody came out of somebody came out of prison, contacted me how to murder on, on they rap on yeah. they rap sheet and got in the truck and doing flat. Tell me. Tell me. But don't put look, I, I I tell people like this. You got that felony, don't season it. Stop if the meat already seasoned. It's like your meat came seasoned, and then you're going to season it more, and you're going to over-season it. And then you're going to get what you don't want, that nasty taste. And what I mean by that nasty taste, everybody's going to say, nah, you know, you got this. No. What you need to do is, I'm not going to let this felony stop me, no matter what. If I get a thousand no's, I'm going to get in right. on the thousand and one. Be relentless. Be obsessed, Speak. man. Are you gangster enough to go for Speak. your dream, uh -huh. man? Ah, come on, man. Come on. Are you gangster enough? Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. They like success. they like the pockets pop. Some of them might like their pockets being broken and popped. And, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't know about that. Everybody will respect you for doing. You. Turn the PlayStation off. Turn the Xbox off. What? Put the blunt down. Yes. Please. Put the liquor bottle down. Put it down. Man. Turn the cell phone off. Study. When you study, turn your phone off. Yeah, and man. and you going to lose friends when you start pursuing success. That's when you see your real friends, your yeah, real homies, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Your real girls yeah. and all that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. You will see it. Yo, we I gotta get rolling. And we just want to bring y'all this to let y'all know back home, don't be scared. I was scared. I doubted myself. And you got to learn how to tell that little voice in your head, shut up. Yo. You really do. Yo, Stay away from the negative people. Don't entertain the negative people because that's what they want. Because once you take your eyes off the road, you're in an accident. So think about it like that. If you look over to see what somebody's doing in their car too long, you can rear in somebody. Yeah, man. So look at it like that when you're looking at them haters. They want you to take your eye off of where you're going and your focus. Because... 
when people come and criticize you and they talk about things you do, their priorities and their life is not straight. And then, you know what? You can't please everybody neither. No, don't try to either. Don't try to. You know, everybody feel you should do something they way. Yeah. And what might not work for somebody else don't mean it's not going to work for you. And you ain't got to get in the truck. It's just any, no. any... If, you are, you if you're a female and you want to be a, a, a RN and you want to be a nurse, be the best nurse in the game. Claim it. Throw it in the universe. I'm the number one rock. I throw it out there. I don't care who don't believe it. It's not for them to believe. It's not their vision. That's my vision. That's my claim. That's the success. I speak over myself. I will continue to be more successful. Bro, the universe was created by words, man. There you go. Create your own world with words, man. That's Stop it. Stop talking negative. Speak it. Speak it. Speak it, please. When you wake up, before you go to bed, while you're walking throughout Get the out. day, I say it when I'm going down the road. Yeah. That's yeah. why I always wake up. Today, I, I feel good. I feel great. I feel blessed, and I am successful. Yeah. And I say that every morning. Because it's hot as, hey, it's hot as all day out here, but I tell you one thing, I'm glad it's not raining. Ha. ha! We gotta go. We, we, we gotta we, go, man. We gotta go. But y'all, y'all thumbs up the video. Share the video. You can follow us at uh, facebook.com forward slash groups Team RG Global. That's where we at. Get in the game. Get your money. Take care of your family. And if you got any questions, leave it down below in the comments. It's your boy Sinister. You already know. Courtney and my Murray, brother man. Courtney Mary. Take Out care of yourselves. Later.